things I find most interesting about creating during this period of COVID is that you really think a lot about um, multi-platform uh, and multiple forms of dis dissemination in terms of work. And so we're really thinking of this as an album, but also as a digital experience, and finally as a work that will live in museums. This is uh, entitled Zodiac, and it's a series of works written by Kelly for uh, solo cello. Uh, so this week, what we're hoping to accomplish is actually to film uh, choreography with uh, several of the pieces for the album. Each piece is preceded by the poem that inspired the piece, read by the poet themselves. There's also a part that's very specific to Mass Mocha, in that one of the solos, which is called Eight Takes, is being filmed uh, with one of the solo lit paintings in mind. So I'm really excited about that because Mass Mocha will remain part of the, the project. We're also working on uh, two pieces, and one of them is um, a dance piece called uh, Ophelia. And, um, and Ophelia actually originates from um, a early 20th century photographer who worked in New Orleans, in Storyville. I am taking on the role of Ophelia in this beautiful Zodiac production. These photographs, E.J. Bullock's photographs, they capture these women as they are. You may see a certain vulnerability behind their eyes. Every day I find a new portrait that speaks to me. And one of the interesting parts is that um, in the film, we are actually going to have another dancer who is in Japan that's going to be composited and that is called House of Incest and it comes from Anais Nin's uh, prose poem uh, from 1936. We are coordinating the choreography with uh, the dancer in Japan who is an incredible Buto dancer from the group Sankai Shuku. I've never done this before but we are now uh, shooting in the green screen studio uh, so that the editor can uh, crop the images and compose it uh, to different uh, shooting materials together. It's going to be very new, I think, that the Buto dancer and ballet is uh, collaborating in such a way. Like, uh, I'm hoping that this will be a kind of model for other performing artists to collaborate uh, remotely. And we, we want to show that uh, it it's has uh, potential, it, it, it's, it works. Working with Hala and Jeffrey and Murat and Dai has been the exact food and nourishment I've needed from this bleak 12 months. This feels like a natural time because of the pandemic. You know, everything else that we were doing slowed down. Um, but as a creative being, you can't not reflect the moment you're living in. So this felt like the right moment to, to put forward, you know, what we were experiencing in our daily lives, contextualized by these older works, and of course, family that we've been growing and creators for about 20 years.